folks, Andrea Cox here with andreacox.com and thedetoxintuitive.com. Thank you so much for being here with me tonight. I have got something really cool to share with you, but first, can you do me a favor? Will you hit the subscribe button, the bell notification button, and the see all button in the top right, left, wherever it is. When you subscribe to the channel, you help support me and my channel. Also, any jewelry you see that I wear or any of the spiritual items that you see, like this Copal Sage Palo Santo stick, you can find in my Etsy store, The Detox Intuitive. Private readings will be found at thedetoxintuitive.com. All of my books, health and detoxification programs, and my blog can be found at andreacox.com. Let's get into your video. So you guys, I thought it would be great to do a video for all of you on how I raise my vibration every day. So the first thing I do, I've got it next to me, but I'm not going to show it to you is I jump on my rebounder. I move my body every day. It's like I wake up, I make an elixir tonic, see my other videos and I move my body. Now, the thing that's cool about the rebounder is it actually moves the lymphatic system. When I'm done with the rebounder, I usually hop in my sauna, but if you don't have a sauna, that's okay. Usually a brisk walk outside in the sun can build up a pretty good sweat for you. Also, if you live in a place that's cold, I sometimes do like a walk away the pounds video, something really simple to just kind of move my lymphatic system. So that is tip number one. Tip number two is I drink high vibrating water. See my other videos. This water has several things I put in it. This container is from Alive Waters. I put things like Orosoma crystals in it, uh, Lugol's iodine, other things of that nature to raise the vibration of my water. I also bless my water by calling my ancestors in to bless everything I put into my body, water, food, etc. The third thing that I do is I eat high vibrating foods. I have been vegan for 21 years. I went vegan in Ohio before it was fashionable. I grew up in farmland. So most of the foods I grow from my garden, I grow about 90% of my food right now. All of my greens, I haven't bought lettuce in the longest time. So lots of fruits and, fruits and vegetables, everything organic. If I don't grow it myself, it is local and organic. So another thing that I do to heighten my vibration is I eliminate toxic people, needy people, energy vampires, people who want to suck my energy out. I eliminate. I just don't tolerate it in my life. Um, I have learned over the years to set really healthy boundaries between myself and others where I know where I begin and the other person ends and vice versa. Full moon, new moon rituals are a part of my monthly practice. Daily spiritual practice is a part of my practice. And I constantly am burning either sage, Palo Santo, or Mexican copal in my house. Now, last but not least are essential oils. You guys know me. You guys know my, my oil videos for Young Living. Ylang Ylang is my go-to oil. It's the only thing I wear for perfume. I also use it on my skin. I also love Orosoma oil. So this is a beautiful Orosoma oil. Uh, this is one that out of chaos comes calm. I usually put these in my right palm, rub my palms together and give my problems up to the universe. I also have these wonderful pomeanders and quintessence to bring in abundance from Orosoma. So every day after I get out of the shower, these essential oils and orosoma oils go all over my body and in my room. I also diffuse them throughout my house. This one is amazing. It's by Soul Naturals. It's called Confidence. And if you take the free health assessment on andreacox.com, you can pick one of these up for yourself. Those of you who follow me on the Detox Intuitive, you know that I often make my own oils. This one has uh, adventuring in it to bring in abundance, rose quartz to bring in that motherly energy. Uh, it has got little sticks of cinnamon for protection. And I do sell these conjuring oils on the Detox Intuitive and in my Etsy store. I just love to kind of put them all over me. I'll put them through my hair. 
and they're all essential oils and they smell amazing and I really feel like they work. Just the balancing with the crystals and the essential oils and the prayer and the meditation, my clients buy these again and again and again. So those are just a few of the ways I raise my vibration. Fresh air, sunshine, uh, being around happy, healthy people, eating a high vibrating vegan diet are things that I've done over the years that I really feel help raise my vibration. I hope you enjoyed this video. I'll see you in the next one. Be well.